and welcome back to Grow with the Jan family. I'm Anjali, and today we're going to be reacting to another VIX ad. It's Generations of Care. We did another VIX ad, which was called One in a Million. You can go check that out. Bring a tissue box. It was very sad. Yes, bring a big tissue box. <laughs> One in a million. That was the first VIX ad we did. Mm -hmm. This was a request for the other VIX ad yes. called Generations of Care. So, let's start, start it, it up. up. All right, made it through. I made it through this the first time without <laughs> tissues. Um, touching though, I mean, yeah. not what I expected to see when she was like, look at my mom, isn't she so pretty? And then you can see why she wants to be a lawyer. Yeah. So, um, and the thing is like, a lot of people judge people based on their looks and like how like, how like a girl can adopt child but a boy can and it's like certain things that you have to do to adopt a child and it's like and we think like about it boys can't wear dresses but that's just because of all the things people put in our minds mm -hmm. and it's just we're not used to it it's just like that's not 
It's not really acceptable. It's just It's like... not really fair. I mean, it's here even in the US. It's the equality. Everybody doesn't have it's... equal rights whether so for me, like it would be nice to see that anybody who is a good person couldn't adopt. I mean, there's so yeah. many children all over the world that need adopting. And I think as long as the person's a good person, you know, it doesn't have to fit into the roles society makes yeah. for us so much. You know, if they can care and love and, you know, provide for a child, um, that's really all that matters. Love knows no boundaries, obviously. Yeah. You know, you can tell in this story that she loves her mom just as much as, you know, the next kid. So... She took care of her, you know, when she was sick and cooked yeah. for her and, um, you know, for her, she, it's her mom. So, you know, it's really touching to see that she's like, I'm going to be a lawyer when I grow up because I need to change the rules. Like, this isn't fair. And, uh, and so I'm going to yeah. fix it. It's like she got taken away from one mom and now she's being taken away from her second mom. No, she's not being taken away. It's boarding school. So she is bringing her there. So it's just like um, a school where the kids go and you sleep there. So, yeah. You, we don't, we have that here too, but it's not something we do. Okay. Yeah, so they're not taking her away. Oh. She's dropping her off at boarding school. And then mm -hmm. she'll come back and get her for the next holidays and stuff. And I'm sure I'll call her. And, but, uh. But she's saying, like, legally her mom couldn't adopt her, you know, because yeah. of who she is. And she, that's why she's like, it's not fair. And my civics, my book says, life, you know, everybody should have equal rights. Yeah. You know, and that goes, you know, across the board, you know, women don't always have equal rights. Minorities don't always have equal rights. You know, your skin is a different color or you look different or you dress different and, um, you know, it's not always about what's on the outside that matters. It's more about what's on the inside. So, yeah, yeah this was a, a cute story. So keep those comments coming. Yes, and if you like this video, don't forget to click that like button down below. Because the more you like it, the more YouTube shares our videos. And we'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Bye.